Welcome back to Hand of Fate. Just defeated the, the King I of wonder. Dust. So I'm not sure who's next. Oh, the Scepter is there. Oh, I'll win the Scepter if I... I don't know what the Goblet is. Or can I do the Goblet? Or that's just... I just get that. Okay, never mind. It's gonna be the Jack of Scales. I get Mana Drain, cooldown times and weapons is doubled. Every combat, the last enemy alive can no longer be stunned or interrupted. Okay. The suit of scales are represented by these lizard men. Quiet, patient, lethally subtle, and coldly intelligent. Of all the creatures I have incarnated as suits, these please me the most. You have taken one of my symbols, but now we begin to play in earnest. My scepter is at stake, and I do not intend to lose it. So we're lizard men. There is an anti lizard man weapon, I believe. Scales. I have saved the lizard men for now, but the stakes have been raised. There is no weapon I will not use against you. Okay, the river. Old river. How will you cross this time? As best I can. Try to be a huge success, too. I don't know. Huh? It works. Unharmed. I think you find some gold or something. Ooh, Heroes Remains. So often, this is how the story ends, is it not? The hero tries, the hero dies. Their memory is celebrated, but they are lost. Okay. Pass a funeral. It's obvious from the size of the procession that the deceased was a well loved figure. You are approached by the cleric. Give me shit. Uh, this great hero befell defending our beloved town of Wandermere. His sword and shield are powerful artifacts, but must be returned to his hometown for proper burial rights to be completed. Will you do this, traveler? I will take the hero's belongings just fine. Thank you. This will mean the world to his family. The town would have revolted had these artifacts not been returned. It is not far for to the hero's hometown. Look to the town cleric when you get there. Viking Blade. Press Such one to trigger an rage. Use of rage and anger. You wouldn't expect it of the barbarian hordes. And pain. A shield bash deals damage to the opponent. Damage increased as you go up in combo tiers. I don't even know what combo tiers are. Yeah, that can replace that right away. And hurry. It is not wise to anger the spirits of the dead by delaying their proper rights. Heavy burden. After five steps, player loses fifty percent max health. Let us see how you progress with that millstone around your neck. Of course, you can remove your curses at shops if you can find them. Still, I'm keen to see how you handle your disadvantages. Okay, this is gonna be rough. We need to return that shit immediately. What's this? Oh, here's return. Oh, it showed me exactly where it is. Altar. Wimsy and Caprice. The domains of the old gods. Were they always thus? Or has age corrupted their natures? On a deserted hilltop in a faraway land, you discover an old altar. The gods of the old religion are powerful, yet unpredictable in their favors. Do you wish to pray at the altar? Let's go for it. Okay, we got decent chances. This is a success. Good. There's no huge success, so it's just... On bended knee, you beseech the gods to aid you in your quest. A distant rumbling and a flash of lightning answers your prayer. One blessing. Lizard eater. Receive one food for every Useful. lizard killed. Yes, especially in the lizard encounters that I'm going to have in the anti-lizard times. And let's handle this. Heroes return. Look. Look deeply. This is the fate of heroes. You reach Wondermare, hometown of the dead adventurer. The town cleric meets you at the gate. He appears to have been standing vigil. Let's return the hero's sword. Thank you. The blade will once again be wielded by in righteous fury. Do you also have his shield? Let's return the hero's shield as well. Truly, you have done the Almighty's work in returning this shield. Thank you. Blessed are we who protected can fell those who trespass against us. Two blessing cards. Attribution. I made that a range attack. too powerful. Ooh. 
I will have to rebalance that next time. And toxic blood. That works for me. You have done blessed work this day. For your services, we will prepare for you a sacred artifact that you may continue your good work through the dark days ahead. Token is mine. And some sort of artifact, hopefully. And do I still have that burden, though? It's gonna suck balls. Okay, let's hitch the ride. A fine companion. I'm sure you'll leave this one in time. You do not seem to have the temperament for friends, even in the animal kingdom. Ooh, the carnival. I appreciate your efforts. I worked hard on this game. Let's see if we can. It is a pleasure to see you play. Get the initial success. A ship dock is worth nothing until it sails. All right, we need some sort of success initially. Oh, just this one. Yeah, that works for me. I like the huge success, but you drift along the various stalls, stopping to look at whatever catches your eye. The mysteries of the carnival await you. All right, so we need like a double success. I think is how this works. Huge success. Yeah. You pass a stall that presents a wide variety of colored vials, elixirs, and potions for sale. A young woman sees her interest and gestures to a bright green mixture, saying, with a thick accent, Care to taste it? It'll not cost gold. You take a sip of the liquid and suddenly decide to drink down the entire bottle. After a moment, you feel refreshed and full of energy. No, no, the woman says, waving away your coin. I say the price... I say, the price you pay, not gold. You pay later. Dealer draws one max health. Okay, so she'll show up later. Alright, little More max health. health to work with. Much good meat do you. Sometime later, you find yourself standing at the edge of a forest. The sounds of the crowds behind you. The day is dawning. Looking back, you see the building. Okay, that's the same. But I get... Oh, I didn't get the thing? I just got max health. Okay. Whatever. Ooh, a helpful priest. Don't take all my shit for once. You need a wandering priest who greets you in a friendly manner. Mm, fine. It's, it's usually a blessing or something. Choose from these options. Okay. He says a few words to get a blessing. After your first Very chance nice card in pick, you may return the card and draw again after shuffling. Chance card. I don't even know what that is. Ladder escape. Mm, I'd like to keep exploring. It's risky though. I'm gonna turn back. So risky. I'm In hoping truth, for a gain though, card. All choices are the devil's choice. Just Even the, the choice one. to do nothing. So they'll either have me fight the big one or the other two. You are no mighty hero. I will let you live with your choice. Alright. I have no specials, I don't think. Blessings, but nice. Oh damn! Damn that. You missed me though. Nice. Oh damn! Oh, that was lucky. He's out of range. I totally tried to counter that. I'm still taking damage somehow. It's just like close presence deals minor damage. Excellent. All right. Give me some equipment. Poverty. When this ring is every sold, every dying man would trade wealth. The player's gold is health. lost, but the player receives max health for every five gold lost as a result. Interesting. Max health. Give me some food, please. Ah, shit. I'm sure you are grateful for that. This is a shop. Yeah. Let's buy food to make my escape. Let's approach the shop. A chance to buy more food. You must be relieved. Alright, so let's see if I have any extras. Max health for every five gold lost this sale. I don't want to do that because I'll be out of food, out of luck. Give me 
wasting all my gold on that. I'm just gonna buy food. It costs five per food, but this is a good deal, I think, right? Get a bonus food. Food is crucial for healing. If you travel without food, your strength will not be restored between encounters. You'll also begin to starve. It seems you'll learn that soon enough. Let's just sell this now. It I get some max health out of it. So, whatevs. And we have some food, at least to get us out of the level. Bam. Let's get out of here. Oh, I get attacked the ladder? That's new. It's not even like a success failure thing. Ah, default weapon. This so sucks. Alright, let's do this. A daytime fight for once. Whoa, shit! Finish them off! Oh, what am I saying? Oh, damn! I hit space too, that annoys me. <sighs> that was quite a fight. For such a non... thing. Some food, I need that. And some more food. Definitely need that. What brings you to play the game? Ha. I know you will not tell me. Yes. Like all the rest. Charity you are part silent. two. Oof. Win this and claim my token. Priest mill on the road. Uh, food to feed the orphans. I've done this before. Um, a worthy decision. Oh, you give them ten food. I feel like I have to, just to find out what this is. Let's do it. It's gonna get me killed, though. Let me see if I have anything in my sack to which to reward such generosity. Uh, okay, just don't pick the fail. Nice. Very good. Blessing card, and the token is mine. Wrath of the old gods. Many of these blessings are too good for the likes. Thunder and one. That's nice. That's I yeah. have a lot of blessings. Take it. Thank you. And now the food's going fast. Uh, she's gonna Feast want food. I have no food. Famine and everything in between. I will give her one food though. Give her one food. What do you know? Well, briefly about what she's seen and heard recently. So adjacent? Okay. Alright. Okay. I haven't seen hunting the huntsman. I have no gold though either. So I'm kinda fucked. I just have to charge forward. Mr. Lionel, what can you do for me? I'm not gonna ignore you. I already have a shield. Healer's ring. Wealth and health. A recipe for a Ugh. happy life. I doubt things will end that way, mind you. Let's try this. The hero of Embertown. You come across an injured adventurer. Blade armor tells you he's seen combat. Pack of thieves. Oh, this is... I've done this before. I gotta track down the thieves. That's placed there. This, I have no resources, but I'll certainly try hunting the huntsman. A challenge for you, and a token it's if you succeed. It's not too hard to track down a mad huntsman who's on a crusade across the countryside in search of a mythical beast. He's been spotted interrogating tavern goers, accosting travelers in the woods, and closely scrutinizing various animal droppings. You hear that he recently left the small town of Thatch Cross and was seen heading into the forest nearby. You follow a set of tracks that lead to a leafy glade. Colorful autumnal debris blankets the ground. You stop dead when you hear the suspiciously loud snapping sound beneath your feet. Oh, well, that's... Oh, this could kill me. Ugh. Oh. This is bad. 
You look down just to see time, the ground beneath you gives way. You fall into a dark pit. Two pain. Five health. Ouch. Mine permanently is Okay, that's max health. That's good. As you rise to your feet inside the pit, you hear a voice. How disappointing. Not only are you not the white minotaur I'm searching for, you're not any kind of minotaur. So careless for you to have fallen into my trap. I'd love to hang around and... Yet it appears that your spelunking has attracted some of the locals. The voice fades into the distance and is replaced with the not-so-stealthy sounds of large creatures approaching the trees. Now I have to fight, too. Okay, I don't have to fight. What an ignominious way to go. The Crucible. I do hope you find something to eat soon. I do, too. I have no gold to buy anything, so I can't even go to the shop. Uh, the only safe crossing the river earns. However, the only adventurers allowed to cross are those who pass through the Crucible. In the crucible, you'll fight monsters for the entertainment of the townspeople. What will you do? I can fight. Oh, the first arena? Choose your opponent wisely. I'm betting on you. Two of dust. That's the easy one. It might be a greater reward the greater the foe. These guys I should be able to take fairly easily. Oh, shit. Do not go on the outside. Just so trapped. Let's do this, bitches. Oh, I finished him. That works for me. Into the spike trap. Nice. Yeah, my freaking thing just annihilated. I don't even think I hit the first guy. Some gain cards, please. You survived that round. Now the crowd awaits your decision. Oh, a jack of dust. I should. I think I just need to rock this and hope there's a good reward because I need food. But they're one at a time, so. And those traps are probably nasty as fuck. It's a different arena. I don't remember. Have I not fight Blizzardmen before? <laughs> Oh, I have no shield. Ugh. Oh, I finished him, though. What happened to my shield? Why was there no shield? Did I not read something? After surviving the crucible, you're paraded through the town and allowed to continue upon your adventure. A few random peasants throw coins, saying, You've made me a rich warrior. You've made me rich, warrior. Okay. The dealer draws four gold gain. And the token's mine. Okay. That's one food. That's some food. Alright. Oh, and I got food somehow. Very nice. Um, I need food now. So let's do this. Could heal me. I can let the food heal me too. So it's kinda oh they have nothing to buy. Maybe I can sell healer ring. Whenever the player receives healing, they gain plus one gold. I like that. And that curse is mana drain, last man standing. Don't need that. Let's just buy a bunch of food. Is that I suppose that's a good thing when there's more. It's a good deal. Should be more than enough. So I'll just heal the rest. I'm sure you're grateful for that. And I'm out of monies. So hopefully, I don't need to buy anything. That was a success. And then I'll heal just by traveling. Let's go. Bam. 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 Oh, Embertown Hero. That's me. I like nothing more than the chance to see how you handle yourself in these circumstances. I mean, if I... If I do Embertown again, I might go along with them. Because if this gives me... It might give me two equipment. Maybe that gives you one equipment.
Hello, boys. Where'd, oh, where'd my shield go? I so need my shield. I'm so confused. Did it break? When I felt me when I fell down the hole, it broke. A little food. Not a great change, but enough to switch the odds a little. I just don't you have can a shield. Always review your cards here. Alright, so here's the next area. Deeper towards our foe. The lizard men are nothing if not patient. He waits for you. Alright, so we are on his tail. Oh, the lock of hair. Give it to me. We play for a token now. Take a swing at the elf maiden's hair with your dagger. Request a lock of hair. The maiden considers this for a moment before slicing a few strands from her hair. As you wish, but be cautious, mortal. You have the taint of a goblin about you, and they may never be trusted. The elders of our kind often say that we must retread paths we once took in order to gain advantage on the present. Farewell. Okay. Look forward one. Jack of Scare. Okay. Now a fight for the ages. I expect greatness. This Lizman's potency allows him to nullify magic. Okay. Latent magic abilities make these Lizman fear about. So I never fought the Jack of Scare. So I'm fighting the Jack and Again, something else is at stake. in the same arena, or did I just run into him early? I'm not sure. I'm not totally sure. But he's just immune, so he's not... But I got no shield. Oh, he's got a tail attack. I just had to dodge like crazy every few seconds, probably. Oh, that's... There's the tail attack. Got some range on that. Oh, man. That's a really long range on him. Ah, oh, damn, I got hit behind. Bam! Get out of there! Finish him! Open up! Mono we mono now, buddy. I have no special. Oh! Played indeed. And the scepter at you the start of the adventure. Something that I never expected to die. More food. 
starting gear upgraded, rat men increase, bandits, more health, lizard men, strength increase. The wand represents my will in the purest sense. It is not too late for you to give up now. Go peacefully to your fate and leave me to mine. I don't you think so. to assemble a credible deck. Let us see what happens next. Praise the gods of the old religion. A 30 gold piece and a demon trader. And for the dead hero of Wandermere, I got the 10 gold per blessing. Interesting. And a war cry. Looks like it has like five charges, maybe. Ring of Enlightenment for the orphans and charity three. For surviving the arenas, you get Armory, Select Two, Noble Trader, A Wife's Fury, and Loan. It's quite Loan Shark stuff. Gaining the Elf Maiden's Hair, I get Goblin King Halls Part Two. Great. Let's see where that leads. Defeating the Lizardmen, you get Queen of Skulls, of course, Metal Ore, Holy Forge, and Dark Ritual. And in the end, we get, also for deleting the Lizardmen, we get the Hernes Antlers and Undead Bane. That seems super useful. Halfway done. Let us continue. And we'll continue on the next episode, so catch y'all then.